Well, let's see who's in here. You're not a ghost. That's good. This woman appears to have had her legs gnawed off. Which accounts for why her corpse is still on the chair. Will you loot her corpse? Oh my god, what is it? What is this game? I'll take the leftovers. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, what up everybody and welcome to Pokemon Snakewood Let's Play! I'm, I'm moving away from the randomizer, I'm moving away from the Nuzlocke, and I've decided, let's have a go. Let's have a go at a ROM hack. Because I've not really had a proper go at a ROM hack on my channel yet, and I think it'd be good. And as it's uh, October, which means Halloween's coming up, and it's spooky, spooky season. <laughs> <laughs> Did I just say that? Spooky spooky season. It's spooky spooky season! So we are gonna do Pokemon Snakewood, which is a uh, ROM hack where the 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 I don't know, there's some sort of apocalypse and there's there's zombies and demons, I think. There's scary things anyway. So before we kick off, let's make sure we've got tech speed on. Fast we have, but most good, frame twelve. Cancel then, because we are on and ready to Go! Yo, if you are hyped and excited for this as I am, make sure you hit that like button. In fact, smash it to pieces. Leave a comment and, uh, you know, maybe maybe subscribe as well. That'd be cool. I'd enjoy that. Okay, let's do this. So far, everything just looks a bit like Pokemon Ruby. So I'm a little bit like... Um... Ah, here we go. This is different. This is different. Ugh, where am I? I don't seem to remember. Who is that man I can remember? He seems familiar. I remember a poke- Oh my god, Bulbasaur, what the fuck happened to you? Oh, my son's dead. But that Pokemon looks strange. I think something very, very odd has happened. It's just my memory playing tricks on me, or was it the Pokemon that I just remembered? Dead. That can't be right, surely Pokemon don't die. They just faint and lose the will to fight, right? The thing is, I don't think I'm making this up. And you are. I am. Oh, that boy looks awful. Oh, she's got a cool hoodie. I'm a grill. I'm a grill. And our name is... Ghost. Because that's spooky scary. I think I've got it. I'm Ghost. I live in Little Root Town. That's right. Okay. Uh, I think I'm waking up. So, okay. So, I'm talking... I'm the main character talking right now, not the professor. Suddenly, you are lasered by giant sharks with laser eyes. No, but seriously, you should leave. Giant sharks with laser eyes. Strange. Okay, there seems to be some sort of earthquake. Okay. And um, we can move again. Good. No music. That's a little bit creepy. The signs. Ghost's house. I was about to be like, oh, that's spooky scary. But no, actually, that's just my name. That's my house. Professor, Bir Professor Birch's house. Oh, I see Pokeballs down there. Little Root Town. A town that can't be shaded at any hue. Is what it used to say, but someone scrawled on it in blood. Help. Oh, shit. This is spooky scary already. So, let's let's see what we can do with these Pokeballs. Then. This Pokeball has an air of ill health about it. Take it. Air of ill health. Hmm... This Pokeball is gently spewing out exhaust fumes. Pokeball is gently spewing out exhaust fumes. So is this... Okay, so this is describing what Pokemon's going to be inside the ball. Pokeball is spinning slowly on its own axis. So... Spinning slowly on its own axis. I don't know about that. Spewing exhaust fumes, that's... Probably coughing. This Pokeball has an air of ill health about it. Air of ill health. Yeah, I don't know about that one. You think poison type though, but... Mm. Right, well, I'm pretty sure that one's coughing, and I don't want to take one that I know, so I want a good surprise. So let's take this top one. Spinning slowly on its axis, take it, yes. Ball toy. Oh, pink text as well, I like that. Nickname this ball toy. Yes, we are going to nickname this ball toy. And we are going to call him, uh, what is he? He's spinning, on, he's spinning on his axis, 
He's a, he's a spooky, scary ghost. So let's call him... I don't know what to call him. What's what's a spooky ghost? What's a spooky ghost name? Yo yo yo! I don't I don't know what a spooky ghost name. Give me a second. Okay, so we're gonna call this thing Marley after the Marley Brothers, which even though that's a Christmas film, it's spooky scary. So well, Christmas film, Christmas story, should I say? It's spooky scary. So we're gonna call him Marley. Cool. Oh, we've got music. I thought you probably shouldn't steal any more than you have. No, that's the one that I took. So let's have a look at Marley then and see what. Yeah, Grand Psychic as expected. Confusion, Harden, and Rapid Spin. That's a pretty good sort. Confusion's a good move to get early. Uh, well, actually, it depends what we're going to come up against. Oh, hang on, he's holding an item as well. Or Amberry. Okay. Uh, I'm going to give that back to him. Because probably useful for him to hold that. Remember, we're not playing under Nuzlocke rules, so we can get... What the fuck is that? Oh my god, I'm in a different dimension. We, we can die and stuff. Like, it's not... It's not a big deal if we lose Pokemon. It's cool. We can just heal them back up for a change. This is a straight up let's play. Okay. Oh, there's a... Okay, there's, a, there's Professor Birch and Green Professor Birch. You're over there. Please help me. Okay. Uh, no, for the love of God. Don't leave me. <laughs> don't leave me to this this thing. Okay. Bruh. 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 You want to fight me, bruh? Okay, this youngster... Oh, no. Zombie Kid Liam doesn't look healthy. He's got a Bulbasaur. Oh my god. Oh no. Bulbasaur. What happened? Okay, let's go for the confusion. It's not very effective, but... Oh, it's super effective. Type... No, he's part poison type. That's why it's super effective. Oh, mind you. No. I think some of the typings are different of like the zombie Pokemon, so maybe it's got a different type. Well, either way... That's the first zombie beat. Grah! The zombie crumbled into dust. Oh my god. That's graphic. Dude, you just stood on that guy's dust, Professor Birch. What the fuck is that? Phew, thanks, ghost. How do you know my name? It's me, Professor Birch. We've known each other for years. What's wrong? All oh, right, you see, I woke up in that ruined town south of here and realised I've lost my memory. So it's true. Little Root has been destroyed. That was our home ghost. I don't know if you remember. Was anyone there? Your older brother, my daughter. No, I don't remember them, though. Do you remember anything? No. You must have hit your head really badly. Don't you even remember the zombie plague? I think I would remember that, but no. <laughs> yeah, you're right. But You were there as the zombies and their zombie Pokemon tore the town to shreds, right? Now you come to mention it, I do remember a zombie Pokemon, but that's about it. Well, you just battled it. Well, I dare say your memories will find their way back to you. Now, follow me. We've got to get to the nearest safe place before the zombies come back. Okay. Oh, and we're in a Pokemon Center. Good start. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's an item in the PC. Normally a potion. Light potion. I uh, don't know what that means. Never heard of one. Let's take a look. Source HP of Pokemon by 20 points. So that's just a potion then. Probably no need to rename it really. So, let's see who we can talk to. Ah, so we can't go any further south, back to Little Root. Let's see what the what the people around here have got to say. She looks like she's a zombie, she's got red eyes. We're staying in Old Dale Town, I don't think we can hold out forever against the zombies, but it's the safest place right now. Okay, so Old Dale Town's a safe zone. Pokemon with you become stronger, you'll be able to go farther away from here. Yes! Standard Pokemon rules taking place right there. Mart What ah, I can buy things in this mark, good. Light potions, antidotes, paradise heal awakening. Not Pokeballs though. We'll get a few of these because I don't know I don't know how difficult this game's gonna be. I don't know if it's just the difficulty curve much at all. So I don't know. I feel like I'm being watched. Oh my god, that's a zombie. Grr. There's a zombie in the Pokemon. Like is nobody noticing this? 
Oh, there's a vending machine as well. Oh, I've just bought something. A can of zombie liver. Oh, man. Let's have a couple of them. <laughs> Wait, what were the bottom two? Zombie liver. No, fresh water soda pop and lemonade, but I've got zombie liver. What the fuck? What does zombie liver do? An undead liver that heals HP by 50 points. Ugh. I don't want to feed my Pokemon liver. That's nasty. Oh well, we keep moving. And I'm guessing this guy isn't going to let us past. Yeah. Wait, please don't come in here. I'm on guard duty and you don't look tough enough to be let out on your own, so stay away. Okay. That's fine. We will go this way as we do in the normal Ruby game. And we'll see what spookies are waiting up here for us. Ah, that's not a spooky looking Wingle. That is a normal looking Wingle. Which means we can just confuse him the fuck out of him. It'll be nice and easy. I am going to um, gently touch this speed up button now and again through this playthrough. I'm going to try not to get addicted to it though. What's this kid got to say? Pokemon is staggering really tired. I should have bought a potion. Yeah, boy. You can have one of mine. Nah, I'm not sharing. I'm not sharing. Zombie apocalypse. There's not enough to go around. Gotta look after number one. Right, and here is Prof Birch. Oh, there you are. Professor, what are you doing? Even when zombies besiege our homes and our entire families vanish without a trace, there is still time for science. For sake, geek. I've made a fantastic discovery, you see. Never before has a Pokemon been known to breed in the wild. How do they exist then? Yet here is a nest complete with egg. <laughs> right. <laughs> Why is this worth talking about? Take the egg ghost. It's common knowledge that eggs only hatch when taken around with other Pokemon. What about the parent Pokemon? I don't see any, do you? No, I don't. But I've got an egg, so that's good. Well, that's only one reason why I brought you here. I also want to speak with you about the zombies. Yes, quite well. I know you don't remember, but do you remember your brother? Three years ago, he beat the Pokemon League. That was a really stupid question. Yeah, well, I want you to go and find him. He and my daughter May set off west a few weeks ago to look for the source of the zombie infection. I haven't heard, I had no hear of them since. Other than the fact that one's your brother and one's my daughter, your brother is the Pokemon champion. If anyone can beat back the zombies, it's him. Okay, well, let's go and get him then. Let's, let's just... Okay, anything else interesting? Go to Petalburg. Okay, so we know we're going to Petalburg because there's survivors there. I'll be trying to reconnect the old PC network so I can try and contact survivors. Okay, and take this. Poképhone! Great name. I can contact you through the Poképhone if necessary. I might do that if I find a lead. Okay. Cool. Right, so I still don't have Pokéballs, I don't think. So, I don't... I mean, let's just get... Let's get the next level. There we go. And... Take a walk. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he didn't give us Pokeballs. Maybe we don't catch Pokemon. I, I, I've not really looked at that. It could be that you don't... You don't catch Pokemon at all. Right, let's just test the Mart out and see if there are now balls in there since we've spoken to Prof. There they are, look. Right, so we'll have five of them. Remember, no one what rules. I can catch as many as I want on as many routes as I want. This is just a straight up playthrough. I fixed my watch now. You can go through whenever you like, but you should buy some Pokeballs. I've got some. This chick wasn't here before. What do you want? Nothing. Oh, but you want me! I see! So you're Professor Birch's new pet trainer. Got you in this errand, Sassy. <laughs> you must be pretty weak-willed. But I suppose I could use the experience from thrashing you. No, for fuck's sake. And here it is. A death caller would like to battle. Good name. And sends in a Sneasel. Uh, ice type? Part ice type, at least. Ice dark? Ah, dark. Oh, I realised that too late. And I unfortunately went for the confusion again, which doesn't hit because it's a dark type. Rapid spin. Oh, that's shy. So we get the berry off. It's alright. Uh, yeah, we don't beat this. Even if I go for Harden to try and hide my defence. It's just going to keep leering me to lower it. Falls for a taunt, and I can't use Harden because of the taunt. So I've got to use Rapid Spin. Okay. 
Dude, this, this girl is not messing around. I hope I don't have to beat her to actually, like, win. Right, I can take another scratch. So I'm good. Falls for the taunt. I'll still use my rapid spin. Keep going for that. If it does go for another scratch on me, I should be able to survive it. Use a poison. And then keep on going. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's close though. A crit on that and uh, I would have been toast. But I, I can beat this chick. I use my light potion. No, 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 not that. Use my light potion. Goes for scratch. Uh, all I can do really is rapid spin. And I think one more. Ooh, one more might finish it off. There we go. What a grindy battle. But we got there. And Death Caller. Mm, you got lucky this time. Dude, I love that robe. I need some of that in my life. Bye, you got lucky, that's all. I suppose I ought to tell you my name so you can tremble the next time you hear it. I just smashed you. I'm going to be trembling. It's Alicia. Now let me pass. Well, she thinks she's something, doesn't she? She doesn't realise that I just kicked her ass, so why would I be scared? And my egg's getting healed up as well. Right, let's have a look at this egg. Because I think I'm going on the wrong thing again. I think Type disease. Wow. I've got a feeling this is gonna be like a um, new Pokemon that they're gonna that they've introduced into this game, because there are some faker mons. And I think that might be the case with the egg. What could it have what could be in this? You'll have to wait to see. A Pokemon obtained by immoral means and it's disease type. It's going to be interesting to see. Okay, so into the next route. Let's see what we can encounter here. See if we can add somebody to the team. I've just seen a guy down there getting eaten by a zombie, but I ain't got time for him right now. What I'm going to do, yeah, is catch myself. Poochiena. I love Poochiena. Uh, can't hit it with confusion because I think it's already got dot type. Mm, I'm gonna try. Yeah, it's already got dot type. That's fine. We'll go for rapid spin. Fewer then. So level three pooch. Anyway, it's gonna stay in the ball, isn't it? But it's good to be sure. One more rapid spin. There it is. All right, now we'll start throwing. And we've got the Poochiana! Very good. So, more spooky names. Let's see what we've got in here. What sounds good for a Poochiana? Uh, ooh, I don't know, but I've just seen a creepy photo that I don't like. Ooh, Pish... Pishacha! That's apparently that's a ghost name from Hindu mythology. Demonic ghosts that feed on flesh and human energy is capable of possessing humans by altering their thoughts. Sometimes leading to madness. Wow, that's a cool name. And it's kind of close to Puchena. It's called um, Pishacha. Spelt as such. P. Sha. Sha. Pishacha. Yeah. Spooky Hindu ghost. Okay, so we've got two Pokemon on the team now. That's good enough for me. Uh, unless I see something that I really want on the team, then we'll catch it, but... My Tien is a monster, so, um... I'm looking forward to getting one of those. Okay, we keep going. And we see... Ah, I see a zombie! This music's way too jovial, I need spookier music. Help! Trainer! Zombie! Ra. Ooh! Here we go. Whoa! That's not a zombie, that's like a... Oh, it's a ghost. Ghost Girl Lizzie. Neon Ghost Girl Lizzie. <laughs> Sends in Polly Hag. I love that. Oh my god, that sprite's amazing. It's confusion this thing to start off with. Goes for bubble. Oh, I'm pot ground type. Ah, that's alright. 
Go scrubble again. Um, what type is my Poochiana? It's dark, isn't it? So that means I can send it in uh, against this thing. It shouldn't do too much damage. And I should be able to finish it and get some experience for Pooch. Yeah. What's he got? Oh, I didn't see what it was next. Rotmander! Oh my god! That is amazing! Oh, I want one of those on my team. I hope we can catch these zombies. Right, Rotmander's fire type. I'm ground type, so even if it comes up with some fire... Well, I mean, I, it's part fire. I don't know what else it is. I guess part disease. As soon as that seems to be a type now as well. And we get a good heal. I mean, good XP. Oh, and Sand Tomb, that's going to be useful as well. Pisha gets level 4. We're going to call a Pitcher uh, for short, because I can't be able to pronounce that every single time. Keep spitting on my mind. The zombie crumbled to dust. Thanks, I'd have died reaching Old Dale if it weren't for you. Please take these, I'm done running now I've reached this town. Running shoes. Good stuff. Ghost, that's me. Whoa, that's, that's going to confuse me so much, I'm going to keep thinking there's a ghost talking to me. I think I remember something. My brother, what's he saying? Ghost, press B to use the running shoes. What a crappy flashback. <laughs> oh, I think I can remember something. This could be something really important. Here's how to run. Cheers, bro. Can't run inside, though. That's annoying. Oh, I can speed boost, so it's not... Oh, shit. It's not such a big deal. Right. Now... I don't want to grind too much because it's boring, but I, I was reading on the description for the page that there are a lot of like invisible barriers in this game where basically if you've not got a high enough level Pokemon, there's no way you're going to succeed. Whoa, I've been spotted. Meat. Oh, she wants meat. So another ghost. Ghost Gold Rika would like to battle. Rika's gone in with Gravil. Gravil. Gra Gravil. That's pretty cool looking again. Right, let's try Santum. See how good that is. Misses. Santum not got very good accuracy. That's something I need to look into in that case. Oh, it hits that time. Oh, yeah, it traps in the Santum, so it does damage every turn, I remember. So, back in with confusion. And it gets confused, so it's getting hurt every time. It's confused. Let's make this a nice little battle. And it goes Greyville. She's got another one. Uh, let's put Pisha out there and see what she can do. Wait, is it a boy? He. See what he can do. Uh, oh, just tackle. Let's get some better moves on this thing. I think I'm just going to try and grind this out because I need to get experience on this so it gets some better moves. Basically, when it gets bite, you, you're pretty set with this thing. Yeah, level five. There we go. How low is attack? I think. And Ghost Girl gets a good level again. Gra! The zombie crumbled into dust. I she was a ghost. Is she a ghost or a zombie? Make your mind up, game. Um, let's battle this guy, too. Oh, hang on. Another pooch in it. Let's just make... Ah, I can't use confusion on him. Idiot. Make quick work of this guy. Oh, actually, no, I'm not going to. He's smashing me up. It's quite a fortunate crit there, because he could have actually smashed me. Zombie, zombie. This zombie is clearly eating. You don't feel like seeing exactly what. Okay, I'll leave him to it in that case. Oh, C-Dot. Um, hit yourself. That's good. And then we'll throw a ball. And we get C-Dot on the team as well. That'd be awesome. Yeah. C-Dot added to the Pokedex. C-Dot attaches itself to a tree branch using the top of its head. It sucks moisture from the tree while hanging off the branch. The more water it drinks, the glossier the Pokemon's body becomes. And let's be honest, we all want a nice, glossy body. So, C-Dot needs a new name. Let's go for... Let's have another, like, mythical ghost. Because I quite like that. I thought that was a good idea. Oh, Revenant from European folklore. An undead corpse or visible ghost that returns from the grave usually for malevolent purposes. Nice. 
Revenant. That is a good, solid name. Yo, leave me some um, nickname ideas for spooky Pokemon in the comments. Otherwise, I'm never, ever... I mean, I'm just going to run out of ghost names, basically. Revenant. I like that, though. Right, well, we're going back to the Pokemon Center. That's where we were going. And we we're going to get ourselves a heal on. Get your heal on. Get your heal on. Brilliant. Right, let's just write down where we are with... Right, who have I got on the team now? I've got Poochiena. And I've got... Um, C dot as well. Welcome to the team, boys. Perfect. Now we may continue. Sorry if you saw my cursor there. Next move, then. That guy's not interested. I don't want a Zigzagoon. Oh, mind you, he's got pick up. No, no, no. Okay. I can deal. I can deal. Uh, berries. May as well get them. Or run berries. Never know, could be useful. Peachy berries. Oh. I just jumped through a zombie. Skitty. Ooh, um. Yes. Oh, that sand seems absolute garbage. Confusion's not, though. Nope. Lowers my attack. Sand going to bring it down a little bit more. And. Pokeball. Yo, I hate that he doesn't do that little flicker at the end. I need that to know that it's not going to pop out. This one's going to be called, let's find out. Skitty is going to be called, ooh, here's a good one from Romanian folklore. Strigoi. Troubled souls risen from the grave, a tradition dating back to Indo-European mythology. Strigos are often seen as being similar to vampires, immortal undead. So, Strigoi. Strigoi has the habit of becoming fascinated by moving objects and chasing them around. Good to know. Give a nickname to Skitty. Yes, Strigoi. I'm loving these spooky names. Strigoi. I'm also loving getting back to doing some... Uh, doing a Let's Play series instead of a Let's Play stream. I'm enjoying it. It's a different... It's a change of pace. Not that I don't love doing streams as well, but... Okay, we keep moving, and let's see. Oh, there's an item down there. What's that? Broke, broken heart. That seems strange. Let's see what that does. One of many that the plague has left in Hoenn. I don't know what that means. I suppose there are lots of broken hearts because the plagues killed people. Like, fair enough, that makes sense. But why is it an item that I can pick up off the floor? Well, let's take on these zombies anyway. Or ghosts, or whatever this one turns out to be. Yeah, ghost girl. Rotmander again. Okay. Rotmander is weak against... Dude, I should be, I should be resisting fire. Because I am ground tight. Is that not a thing? Oh, maybe I'm making that up. Hit it with another sand tomb. Because, because, because... It's super effective. And we get the crit. Not that it matters, because we've already beat it. Good, that thing was level 9. This, The level curve here is getting a little bit ridiculous. I'm going to be honest. But ha The zombie crumbled into dust. Oh, that wasn't the noise the zombie was making if it was crumbling. It sounded a little bit too uh, victorious to be crumbling. You honestly, end of this series, I'm gonna make a compilation of me making zombie noises. You're gonna fucking love it. Zombie Kid Allen sends out Boilbasaur. Oh, we've seen I've seen too many Boilbasaurs, so I don't like it. My boy. My boil. So I got it stuck in the sand too. Smash out of confusion. Yeah, that's easy enough. Easy enough. Yeah, question of the day. I'm going to add that to the layout that I've not made yet. Yeah, question of the day. What is a good name for a spooky spooky Pokemon? Good nicknames. Let me know in the comments. Let me know the ones that you call your Pokemon when you catch ghost Pokemon. 
and I will put them. I will make sure I uh, make a note and use them. Dude, that guy's blue. I mean, he, he's less a zombie and more like a smurf. Okay, we are in Petalburg, which... Petalburg looks like it's pretty run down. There's buildings that have collapsed. A medical kit. The wounds of the Pokemon were completely healed. Okay, so we found a med pack. Uh, let's... I don't know. I don't really know who I want to trade. You're going to be a Shiftry. And that's cool. So let's get you out from Oh, there's a zombie in the town. I see. This is something we're going to have to look out for. Trainers in towns now because... Obviously, zombie outbreak, they're everywhere. Ghost Girl Danny would like to battle. Oozle! Dude, that's... Is that Squirtle? That's Squirtle! Let's try a bite to see how that goes. I don't know how much damp... Oh, hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no, we should be okay. Bubbles and grass types, so that's not super effective. Not going to do too much damage. There we go, and then we'll, we'll unleash, and that's going to do quite a bit. Yeah. I might even be able to go again. Uh, should we have a go? Ah, uh, it tackles before we can get the bide off. Yeah, there we go. Okay, down goes Revenant. That's okay. We're not doing those what rules right now, so I'm happy with that. We'll just swap out. I'm a bit pissed off that I'm not going to get the experience from it, because I think C dot will be very useful. But we'll Marley gets level 9. Play defeated Ghost Girl Danny. Gurk. Gurk! Rah! Honestly, lots of... A, a wide array of sound effects. Is there not a Pokemon Center in this town? Aha! Your, your ghost? How do you know that? You look like your brother. Are you going after him? Yes. Then you will... Then will you bring peace and put the dead back in their graves? Yeah, sure, why not? I <laughs> Yeah, sure, why not? I believe your brother and his girlfriend were headed into Petalburg Woods when they passed through here. Now, please go and... Oh, shit! Oh, no, these zombos! Quick, run for it! I'll hold them off for as long as I can! Oh no, he, he's gonna get he's gonna get destroyed. Ah! Wow, they they finished him off quickly. Dear me, poor guy. I didn't even get his name. It's impossible to enter the doors of firmly wedged shut by a mess of schools and stuff. <laughs> schools and stuff. Well, let's see who's in here. You're not a ghost. That's good. This woman appears to have had her legs gnawed off. Which accounts for why her corpse is still on the chair here. Will you loot her corpse? Oh my god, what is it? What is this game? I'll take the leftovers! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, I'm gonna give her leftovers! I'm gonna give her leftovers to a Pokemon to heal them up! I can't believe that! Oh, this is sick! Oh no! Uh, who can, yeah, you can have the leftovers. Oh shit, dude, that is rough. Oh, that poor woman. Oh. Okay, I feel a bit sick. Let's go and. Oh hey, oh, oh, I seem to have changed colour. What's that? Supply crate. It contained a potion. Take the potion. Yes. Ah, so this supply crate's knocking around where you can pick up items. That's interesting. Well, how many of these can I take? <laughs> this is definitely some sort of glitch, but I've got it, so I'm good. And we keep moving. Okay, there's a Zombo there. What do we have down here on the beach? Oh, oh he's, he saw me from miles away. No, these are my items. I wasn't going to take any items from you, you dick. I am now, though. Looter Lawrence. Oh, I see. We're in a zombie apocalypse. There are looters. That makes sense. And it's C-Dot versus C-Dot. Your C-Dot looks better, but I'm going to use Bite. Oh, you're going to use Harden, which is stupid. And then you're not going to hit me with anything, and I'm going to unleash no energy. Now you're going to use Bite. Well, I'm going to use Bite, too. And we'll just Bite each other out. Right, now you've done your Bite. I'm going to switch in for... Let's get Strigoi out there. I don't think you've got any physical attacks, so as long as I'm careful with this bide, it should be okay. Now I can afford to do that, and it's going to unleash, and it's not going to do much. There we go. Now, Tackles goes for bide. So now we Growl. 
storing energy again. Tail whip as well, why not? Get the defense down. I was sat doing nothing. Unleash energy, which is zero, and we go for attack again. Good tactics, give us provide. Ah, I see, I've got this in the bag. Oh, I tail whipped again, I was meant to use tackle. Hang on. Just keep tail whipping until its defense is like zero, and then it's going to unleash. Now I can tackle. Down goes C dot. Revenant grows to level four. Stringoy, hopefully, that should be a level. No, just a bit shy. Taylor, it scuffles! It scuffles, and I'm sorry. Scuff oh, scuffles have killed me. Dude, these levels, these Pokemon levels are high. So let's get Revenant out there. Oh no, that was stupid. Uh, because I'm weak to that. Mind you, I'm put ground type, which makes me weak as well. But, uh, never mind. Confusion. Where we're going to start. I don't think it's got a pet, so I think we're okay. Just going for quick attack. There it is. So my plan here is to get through Petalburg Woods, and that will be the end. The end. Revenant gets to five. Marley gets 49 experience as well. And Luta Lawrence, not even my stolen items could protect me. Sorry, dude. What a twisted world this is. Yeah, I know. What about this girl? I lost everything. The zombies ate my family and destroyed my home. What little I had left was stolen by looters. Stop, stop. Uh, you want a battle? I'm trying to extract some salt from the seawater. If the zombie tastes salt, it turns back into a corpse. Haitian legend say so. Dude, those Haitians aren't the most accurate people. I just tried to get Mr. Briny to take me to Duford because it's an island. Zombies can't cross when in water. Oh, but Mr. Briny tried to eat me. <laughs> okay. So Mr. Briny won't be taking us across the water in this one then. Shame. Uh, I just want to loot that. Oh no, not loot. I want to heal and then we can go back. Yeah, we'll take on this zombie as well because we need to be getting these levels up because they're already getting a bit ridiculous. Um, let's keep Revenant out there. The zombie looks kind of ill and seems disinclined to attack. Perhaps it's the salty sea. Here. Well, maybe the salt does work then. Who knows? Trainer. Another looter, probably. I will defend my right to thief to the death. To the death! It's very dramatic. Looter Richie has got himself a Surskit. We're good with that. It's level 11, though. Jesus Christ, these levels are flying. I'm definitely going to be doing some grinding between episodes, because this is unreal. It goes for bubble. Just hold on. Oh, it's still, that's going to kill me. Oh, no, it's not, but I'm definitely going to kill it. Oh, no, I don't. Okay, do good damage, though. Let's get... Oh, man. I don't know what to do. I don't know whether to just train up one guy and just get him, like, super sky-high level. Just annihilate everything. Oh, shit. Right. Now, now that thing's going to be faster than me. Yeah. Wow, this is difficult. That's going to be super effective. Oh, but I've got good defense. That's good to know. Confusion. Another one of them. Oh, he's got a full restore. What a son of a bitch. All that hard work. Keep going with the confusion. <sighs> Shit. I don't know if I can beat this. Come on, Stringoy. There we go. So, some good experience all around there. Revenant gets some experience. Stringoy's just going to get some. That fucking arsehole. I'll have to steal better items next time, yeah, boy. And we have Oran Berries. Perfect. And we have Pekka Berries. This is good. Right, I don't want any of this, though. I just want to get back to the healing thing. And get into Petalburg Woods. Taylor, okay, we need... I need to catch Scuffles as a matter of urgency, if we're honest. Just hit me, man. I'm biding. Wow, it really doesn't want to hit me. Oh, it has got Peck. That's good if I come up against any grass types. So, Pokeball, I choose you. Yes! And we can add a Taylor 
to the T. What do you call a scruffles that's a ghost? A scruff, spook, spook, fools, spook fools, spoofles. I'm thinking Spectre, sp spe scr <laughs> um, uh, Okay, okay, I've got a good one. And we'll just put... Oh, I need to click off of that. What the fuck am I doing? Yo, 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 what the fuck is that? <laughs> Something was going very wrong there. Um, we have to get rid of one of them because I want to go F L E S Scruffles. Wait, always take those scuffles actually. Oh, I don't know. Oh, it's going to be Scruffles. I'm sorry if I've named it wrong. I don't care though. So I'm not really sorry. Is what I'm trying to say. Okay, into the forest. Trainer tips. Any Pokemon that appears even once is awarded XP. Yes. I know that. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So, any items over here? Uh, Cascoon! I'm not going to catch that, just in case I come up against something that I would rather catch. Meanwhile, in this forest. And I've only got one Pokeball. I don't want to have to keep coming back through here. That guy didn't battle me. I'm Larry the Looter. I've looted so much stuff that I've planted spare. Take a look at my wares and see if there's anything you want. Ooh, it's a mart! Water bottle. Heals Pokemon of a burn. Pokeballs. Okay, so I can get some more Pokeballs here. So let's just get another th three. I don't need super potions because I've got those, uh, what are they called? Livers. Zombie livers or something like that. Uh, that's all, I think. I think that's all. We'll save a bit of money. An item there. Super potion, so we definitely need to catch super potion. And if we come down here, there's an item there as well, which is another Pokeball. Brilliant. Let's have a chat with this chick. Gasp, gasp, we've been running from the zombies for days now, but they're everywhere, and my Pokemon can barely carry on. You have a spare potion, can I have it? Yeah, sure. Literally, you saved my life. Please take this small gift in exchange. Anadrin Talon. Yo, she's just disappeared like a ghosty ghost. But what is an Anadrin Talon, I hear you ask? I hear nobody ask. A hold item that raises the power of flying type moves. I don't know where that's going straight away. That's a pretty good item to get. Not going to front. Right, worm pull. Oh, you know what? I need to be doing. I need to be battling these things, but. Jesus Christ, it's hard work. Especially when they're a high level. Nah, I'm super effective against... Oh my god, that thing just destroyed me! I was about to say I'm super effective against all these bugs, but Jesus! That thing was not messing around. String shots slowing me down. Tackle. There we go. Revenant grows to level 7. And then grow... Oh god. Learn something good, man. Strigo gets level 6. There we go. And we keep going. So, who's up front at the minute? It, I believe... Why do I keep going to bag when I go to Pokemon? I believe it's Revenant. Yes. Uh, let's keep him out there. Let's get another level on him if we can. And then we'll swap it about a bit. Item there. Yo, and we've got a Casco Again. Um, I'm not going to get in a battle with that. Paralyze heal. Cool, that could be useful. Yeah, loads of cascoons in here and worm pools that I'm not interested in. No, you mustn't go on, man. There are things so powerful and terrifying. I can't let you throw your life away like this. I'm not going to, honestly. I'm going to kick ass, I promise you. I'm not throwing my life away. It is Survivor Lil. And he's going to send out a slack off. Dude, that's, that's going to be power. So let's bide it and see what it hits me with. Encore. So I can only go for bide again. That's fine. Goes for scratching now. It goes for scratch. Right, okay. 
That doesn't end well, so let's get Marley in. Confusion. Comes confused. Oh, okay, so we, we smashed that. that. That wasn't serious, I thought. Next, we've got Wormpool, and I. Uh, my, <sighs> my lovely spooky ghost bird is already down, so I can't do anything with that. So that's confusion. Sticking with Marley. Get some levels on this guy. Nice one. Next, Rolls, which is part of Psychic. No, it is Psychic type. So let's just grind it down with confusion. It's going to do the same back. Oh, mind you, actually, what about Rapid Spin? No, you know what? Confusion's better. Try Sand Tube. Oh, we get the crit. And it goes down, so either way. That's a happy result. Marley gets level 10. Survive a lil. Please don't. You'll die too. I'm not going to die. I promise you, Survive a lil. I'm going to kick these zombies' asses. Ah. Levitating Legless Corpse. That's a convenient name. The pain. Levitating Legless Corpse. Young one, your body looks in better shape than this decrepit one. I shall possess you instead! You fucking won't. Yo, she's a nasty looking bitch. Demon Corpse. Oh my, oh my god, that's a handle without a head. Um... Okay, I'm guessing it's still part fire type. Using attack plus the attack of foe hand or raised. Okay, that's an item. Uh, so I think I can stand to me and it should still be super effective. Yeah, so the typing, it might have changed somewhat, but it still has fire in there somewhere. Which means I can stand to me again. Oh, I get, it gets the paralysis off, but... Uh, ah, and there we go. Trigger is in, and we'll get the tackle off with you. Uh, if it goes, I was about to say if it goes for a potion, I've got no chance. <sighs> okay, let's get our other dog out. Okay, this is a battle I'm not winning, dude. This is this is like hard mode Pokemon Ruby right now. Shit, a break. I'm so glad I didn't decide I was Nuzlocke in this as well. Jesus. Okay. Uh, oh. Little tackle. Well, there we go. Not much I can do about that. Well, where, so where's that going to take us back to? Back to the bag. We're fully healed. Yeah, you know what? <sighs> it's annoying, but it's it's not bad. It's okay. I think... I get a few levels on everyone before the next episode. I should be able to beat this. I should be able to beat that guy. It shouldn't be too difficult. Yeah. Right, well, well, wrap it up there then. Thank you all very much for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, make sure you uh, look at these plugs that I've like put up on the screen here. Or maybe here. Might have some coming from each side. Who knows? Check out my social media anyway. They're on there. And, uh, yeah, see you next time. And we're going to beat that guy and go on to Rustboro and see what the state is up there. See if there's a gym there, even. I don't even know if there's gyms in this. Is there gyms in this? Oh, I don't know. I need to find out before I make the border for it so I can put gym badges on it if there is. But I will work that out myself. I don't need your help for that. See you all next time. Peace. Oh, I press the speed up, bud. Bye.